one final time I have clasped the hand of a legend. Now we're going to go to the final feature of this series. For one final time, I'll be sent across to far distant lands. For one final time, I will be able to flirt outrageously with attractive ladies. And for one final time, you will ponder the moral implications of the fact that I get paid for all this. We had a number of options for this week's feature. We could have covered binary code programmers in Leicester, machine operators in Swindon, or glamour models in Tampa Bay, Florida. I think we made the right decision. Here's your tea, Dominic. Thanks, love. Yes, Gillian Bonner is quite literally a glamour model who takes a good photo. But she also happens to be one of the few women to own her own software company, as well as star in its first title, Rihanna Rouge. <laughs> Like me, Gillian's a person who's very comfortable with her body. But as we sat chatting by the lagoon that banks onto our splendid home, I couldn't help wondering. So, Gillian, what's a lovely lady like you doing in a horrible industry like this? Well, I uh, was interested in high school, and then after modeling in New York for a number of years, I retired from that and opened a mail-order hardware, computer hardware company. Is, was it easy to get it started off? Well, it took money, and I, I rounded up the most knowledgeable people I could to, to help me. And, of course, I learned a lot by doing that. But I hated that part of the industry. So mm -hmm. it just wasn't creative enough. So, Rihanna Rouge, what's it all about? Oh, well, it's about the making of a superhero. She starts out as a, a really downtrodden, abused secretary with no, no self-esteem. And um, through the player's choices, she eventually ends up as a superhero. Right. Gillian is very much the driving force of the company and is well versed in the intricacies of game production. Each section of the game was meticulously storyboarded before Gillian and her pals up sticks to shoot the live action material in a studio in Los Angeles. Ready, action. These chroma key scenes were later composited into the various environments that Rihanna encounters. Her progression from timid secretary to hard as nail superhero is mirrored in a selection of eye popping outfits. Okay, so we've come into Gillian's private study here where I'm going to take a look at her pants, basically. <laughs> uh, so Gillian, show us some of the costumes then that, that you wore in the game. Okay, what little costumes we have here. Yeah. This is, um, was worn in Fun World, which is pretty cool. That's nice, very Alice in Wonderland. Yeah. This was Tree World, and um, it was a really great world to work on. Uh-huh. All um, tribal and feather. There are some members of Parliament in Britain that wear stuff like that regularly. Just, yeah. They do, trust me. Uh, I believe you. Yeah. <laughs> this is the uh, final when she becomes a superhero. She uh -huh. wears this outfit with all the spikes and chains and everything. That's Great. cool. Yeah. It's just a pity that none of them come in my size. Indeed, Gillian's no slouch when it comes to giving the public what it wants. No doubt when Rihanna Rouge hits the shelves later this year, Gillian Bonner will be not only beautiful and intelligent, but wealthy too. No wonder I took a few precautions to make sure my stay didn't end too soon. Well, uh, that's it, and Gillian's very kindly offered to uh, give me a lift to the airport. Looks like it won't start. Oh, no. Guess you'll have to stay. Mm.